Hey, what's up everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Dragon City, and in this video, we're gonna talk about a couple different ways to get the new Wisp Dragon. From August 4th to August 11th, right now, we can get the exclusive Wisp Dragon. Find him in the Breeding Island, in Offers, or in the Phantom Runner Island, and check out his new quest. So here, there's three different ways to get this dragon. It's a legendary dragon, the Wisp Dragon. If you're level nine in Dragon City, then you've got the Event Breeding Island, which we'll check out in a second. Here, there's also gonna be the offer, and then starting August 7th, which is in a couple days, here we're gonna have the Runner Island. So from August 7th to August 11th, that's one of the ways that's gonna be probably the most uh, easy, air quotes, to get the, f uh, the beautiful Wisp Dragon. It's still gonna be difficult. We're gonna have to get a lot of those flight stamps and, well, you know Runner Island, we're gonna have to avoid a lot of mountains and boulders to get those beautiful pinwheels to collect those rewards. Here, I'm gonna try something real quick. We're gonna try the Event Breeding Island. I've never had any success with that, but I don't really want to go for the offer. Here, there's the offer. It's $13.99 Canadian currency. Of course, that's better than $27.99 but I'm not going to be spending any money for this dragon here. It is a cool opportunity though. It's a light, a light sea, ice, and electric dragon, and you can also get that food as well. That's one way to get the dragon, but if you want to try to get the dragon for free, here we've got the breeding event island. If we do a little bit of scroll in here, we can see that if we breed Terra and the Sea Dragon, here we have a chance of getting the new Wisp Dragon. So this is available for the next six days and 17 hours, so about seven days we have this opportunity. So Terra and Sea. That's gonna give us a breeding time of a day and 12 hours if we get lucky enough to get it. So let's go ahead and make some space real quick over here. Here, I'm just gonna go ahead Take that dragon, we can place it right there, awesome. And that's looking fantastic. And here, what dragons do I have? So here, I'm just gonna make some space. We've got our ultra breeding tree over here. And, whoops, I'm having a brain fart, uh, what was it? Here, we're gonna go to the wisp dragon. There it is, Terra and C. Okay, so Terra and C, I got this here. We're gonna choose our strongest Terra Dragon and our strongest Sea Dragon. Here, we see that the Sea Dragon is a level 25 and it has four stars of empowerment. When it comes to my Terra Dragon, here we've got a level 26 Terra Dragon and it has, a, it was five stars of empowerment. So that's really good there. Here we've unlocked the Empower exclusive, but that's not necessarily the dragon we're going for. We're going for the Breeding Event Island Dragon. So here, if I want to give myself some extra chances, let's see if we can't empower the sea dragon one more time. So like here, we're looking for the sea dragon there, huh? Okay, so we're not gonna be able to uh, empower that sea dragon right away, but if I could get that fifth star of empowerment there, that would up my chances for getting those dragons. Here, just to give us a little bit of an extra boost, I'm gonna feed the Terra and sea dragon a little bit here. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna go to level 30. Now, that looks perfect there, beautiful. And then we have our sea dragon, which I'm also gonna take to level 30. The higher the level, the more um, you know chances you have for getting those rare breeds. But with when it comes to the breeding event island, it's just difficult in general. So there, we've uh, you know leveled up our dragons a little bit, we've really upped our chances, and we're gonna go Terra, and the second dragon is our beautiful, fabulous sea dragon here, and new, oh, here we didn't get that new symbol right there, so already I know we didn't get the wisp dragon, but that was a good opportunity there, yeah. Awesome, so that's looking fabulous, and uh, I'm definitely gonna be playing the runner island right now, We've got the uh, Maze Island going on, and here we managed to get a couple of those rewards there. Here, win quest battle. Okay, so the Puzzle Island there, a lot of fun. If ever you're trying to get those dragons there, good luck with that. Hey, and we also have the Grid Maze that's going on right now. I already made a video on that, and I'll be making a new video when that, uh, you know, progresses a little bit there. And what else do we have going on? Here, I've been working on my towers. Ah, no luck there. 
Is there anything else here? We've got another tower there, just some food. I'll take the food though. And here at No Luck as well. Here, if we go to our quest battles, we can check out that there's the Wisp quest. Now, if you manage to get the Wisp Dragon, then I highly recommend you level that dragon up to at least level 20 and above. So you can play all of these different battles here. Here, each stage can give you 10,000 food, which is great. And if you manage to get to stage 15, then you can get 120 of the orbs of the Wisp Dragon, which is just what you need to empower that dragon and get the first star of empowerment, which can make this dragon even stronger. If that's the route you're going with, good luck. I really hope you win it and get everything you're looking for. Oh, yeah. Here, when it comes to the broken mirror quest, we can go ahead and give this a little try here, and let's go. Hopefully, we're going to get that victory. I have a good feeling usually these battles go pretty well here, and they're a great way to either rank up your dragons and, uh, you know, get that A-plus that we're all looking for there, and just have a little bit of fun. Oh, yeah. Here, this is going super good, and I'm pretty sure we're going to get those moves for Puzzle Island. Yeah, there we go. Looking good. So... That went super smooth there, and I'm going to keep on doing my best. Here, we're going to go ahead and collect those puzzle moves, and I'm going to keep doing my best to get those awesome dragons that we've got over here. Hey, thanks again for watching, everybody. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like, and subscribe for more Dragon City tips, tricks, and strategies coming your way. Hope to see you soon. Happy gaming. Peace.